Hi everyone, welcome to Patty's Polish Corner. Today I have a exciting video for you. Um, it's using the Wave Gel Cat Eye Nail Polishes, finally, in a nail art design. And I got the idea from Tess Walters on Facebook. So I will link her Facebook um, page in the description box below. And this is just a completely fun abstract cat eye design and I oh my gosh it's so much fun to do and I completely love the outcome so let me start babbling and let me show you what I did so for this design I'm gonna be using wave gels shiny top coat and base coat I'm going to be using jazzy tonight and this cat eye number three all of those are available at rushhourbeauty.com and I will link my description or my uh my discount code in the description below. <laughs> then I'm gonna use Out on the Town by Kira Sky. I'm gonna use the gel version, but I just love showing you the hollowness in the bottle. So I'm showing you the non-gel version. Ooh. <laughs> then I've got the um Cat Eye Magnet from Wave Gel, and I've got my Masora Magnet here as well. Okay, I've got my base coat applied, and today you're going to get to watch me paint my nails. So I don't forget which nail gets which polish. I'm going to apply Jazzy tonight, just a really thin coat on my ring finger, because this is where my glitter is going to go, and I just want a base for it that way I don't have to um you know sponge it on or anything like that it's a pretty thick glitter anyway but I just don't want to have any bare spots and I don't want to have to um you know sponge it on so I just don't want to mess with that today so there we go we got jazzy tonight on my ring finger and on my finger finger hmm. wonderful okay <laughs> okay so we got that down well almost hang on a second okay there we go just get past that okay all right so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply the Cat eye number three, which is purple. Now this is a very thick um, cat eye, so you don't need undies. Isn't that wonderful? A lot of the other cat eyes, well, actually I've only tried one other one. I bought another one. I can't remember if it, I think it needed stuff underneath it too. I think it needed black, but um, but my other, my other two brands needed on these. And, but this one doesn't. This is a very thick, it's like, it goes on like silk. It's complete, I mean, look at that. It is completely amazing. It is so beautiful and silky and you don't need anything underneath it. It's completely opaque. So that's cool. So I'm just going to put this on the rest of my fingers. I'm going to cure it and I'm going to come back. To do something fun so once you get your bait once you get your first coat on then you're gonna um then you would do your magnetic coat coat wow <laughs> okay but we're gonna do something different and fun and I hope this really works out because I have not practiced it so I will be very disappointed if it doesn't work out okay so yeah, I think that's good right there. I could go down a little bit. I could go over. Okay, so now, now, um, you can only do the magnet. Sorry, hang on. I got this little thing right here I want to get rid of. Um, so you can only do the magnet when the, um, the gel is 
have been cured. So I just put it on part of the nail and I will show you, you will find out why. <laughs> so I'm going to go in with the magnet right here. And if you don't like how the magnet thing turned out, just go right over it again. Okay, so we're going to hold it really close for about three seconds. One, two, three. Oh, there we go. Totally awesome. Okay, I'm just going to show you on the one nail. We're going to do the one nail full in the, um, right now, and then I'll do the rest of them off camera. Okay, so I'm going to, um, I'm going to do a second coat of that because I just want more coverage. And the reason I'm doing it with Jazzy tonight, I could have definitely used my, um, my cat eye gel, except for that cat eye gel is $12 a bottle and Jazzy tonight is only $8.50 right now. Okay, so that cat eye is um, cured. By doing it in layers like this, I can um, do each cat eye going in a different direction and give it some depth. At least that's what I'm going for. Okay, let's go to that spot. There we go. And let's see, I went that way, so I want to go this way. Ooh, there we go. I got that. Cat eye is doing something crazy here. Okay, so now I'm going to go and cure that. Okay, there we go. Kind of like a two layer cat eye effect and now I'm just going to do the tip. Let's see if I can concentrate the cat eye effect more in this corner. I'm using a different magnet here. It's I'm a Sora magnet. Ooh, yeah, liking that. Ooh, that looks cool. Okay. Well, that is kind of awesome. So I am going to cure that. I kind of just added like some random patches. So I'm just going to go in here. Ooh, well, I kind of like how that's turning out. Okay, I think we're good with this one. Right now we're going to focus on my ring finger here. And I really love this Kira Sky glitter. It's nice and thick and it's got tons of glitter in it. And it's actually beautiful. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm like completely addicted to this glitter. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Oh, and you guys can't even see the hollow iciousness. <laughs> um, darn. All right. Well, we'll see what we can do. So as you can see, I already started to do my second pattern on the other nails. But let's focus on the glitter. Yeah, let's focus on that glitter. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful glitter. I, I am completely in love with Kira Sky glitters. They are completely amazing. And they've got like a quite a few different colors, but they're not easy to find and they're not easy to find the colors, what the heck they really look like. So I had to do a lot of searching on the internet. 
Okay, let's cure it up. I don't think this is going to need a third coat, but I just love it, so I'm going to stick a third coat on there. <laughs> just a little so pretty. All right, and I'm stopping at three coats. No more. No more glitter on the ring finger. So now you can see I've got some like wild cat eye pattern going on here. I completely love it. So for the last step, we are just going to smooth it out with some tuck coat. I'm just going to do that to all my nails, and then I will come back for the final look. And here is the finished look. How's that for some abstract cat eye effect? Actually, I was just about to take a picture when I realized the record button was on. So I'm like, oh, okay, maybe I'll talk. Here's the finished look. I kind of love that abstract um cat eye effect. That's completely awesome. Okay, so here's the real ending of my um, video. This, um, this glitter just happens to have a real subtle hollow look. And as you can tell, the camera likes this angle a whole heck of a lot better. Um, not bad for my first shot at abstract, um, abstract cat eye. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.